Attention citizens. <laughs> Hello. Welcome back, my friends. If you're new here, I am Lance. If you're returning, welcome back to the Reactor Spotlight, where we watch our favorite reactors. It's a reaction inception. Now, today we have a subscriber request by Carla Marie. I can't spit this out today. This is the fourth time I'm trying to do this intro because I. It's been like two days. I haven't like done recording. I've been dealing with the Abigail movie, so I, I, I'm kind of like two days. I haven't. I go. I, I get. I get lost. Carla Marie, you requested J Meets World, the Poughkeepsie tapes. Poughkeepsie tapes. Say that three times fast. Uh, show love to Carla Marie, first of all. And second of all, show love to J Meets World. She works hard to edit down these movies. Show love to J by becoming a subscriber, a channel member, or a Patreon member. Show her some love. Check out her archive of videos. And also, if you'd like to support me in the Reactor Spotlight series and the ch this channel in general, uh, I have Cash App, Venmo, and Super Thanks. You can give a tip on, or you can support me through become a, a channel member, become a Lance's bestie alongside my other besties, or you can head over to Patreon and support me over there. I just put up the full length movie of Abigail, and I am promise you guys we are heading to season three of True Blood. I promise you. It is in the works. I, I haven't recorded yet, but we're getting there, guys. Please be patient with me. I'm trying to I believe in person. And uh but yeah, also I have a gaming channel. Uh check me out on my gaming channel. And also on Instagram and Twitter. I'm also active on I've been a little trying to be a little bit more active on Twitter, even though it's be a cesspool, but I've been trying to be more active on it. And uh, yeah, I'll, I've, and I've been more active on Facebook. So face, find me on Facebook. Also, you know what helps with the channel and the algorithm is leave a comment. And if you don't know what to say, just say. I've got the power, power, power. All right, now let's check out J Meets World, the Poughkeepsie tapes. And we can arrive the boogie. Hello. I hope everyone is having an amazing day. That was a cute little hello across the screen. I like how she ended that in. I like that. I had to figure out. And the, and the little music, the little, the little shimmery sound. Sorry. A while back, I started a found footage journey. It turned into a quick trip because I haven't been back to found footage, but I am today. Um, so yeah, so what was the movie that made you stop want to watch found footage? That's the interesting one. What was the film that made you go, you know what? I'm going to go down a different avenue and I'll come back to you. That kind of vibe. So I'm kind of curious on what that is. Now the Poughkeepsie tapes, I, I love found footage. I, I didn't realize I, until I started thinking back one time, because the horror hour talking about found footage. And I was start thinking, I was like, you know what? I really do like found footage because a lot of the ones I do enjoy are found footage. Surprisingly, I didn't even think about that until that one episode of the Horror Hour. So today we're watching the Poughkeepsie tapes. I don't like the name of it. It sounds terrifying enough. Oh yeah. I don't know anything about these tapes. I haven't seen a thing about this movie. It came out in 2007, so I was in middle school. I'm Bruh. really stalling. What? 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 The hell you just say Sam about this movie it came out in 2007, 2007. So i was in middle school I'm in 2007 you were in middle in middle middle school you were in I girl you make me sound old you, this girl could be my like daughter hey jesus christ i'm gonna shut this shit down you already i'm yeah i'm, I'm this is a horror i'm depressed i can't I'm really stalling here because I'm kind of ner nervous. But I'm just gonna go. We're just gonna go ahead and watch it. Uh, but before we jump in, please comment, like, and subscribe if you like what you have seen so far. You can definitely join down below, become a member, or go over to Patreon and join there, where you can see the full watch along for this and get early access to the edited. Her hair's eating today. 
her hair has this like wave in it. It's just it's like making me just look at all the like the sheen to it and everything. Like the work girl work. Versions of my reactions. I do want to give a huge thank you to everyone who is members right now because without Girl, you, look at you, you know, with all them potrons. So the, the, the potrons. You guys so so look so, so much. Even if you're just viewing this video, I appreciate you. Like you do not understand. Anyways, let's just go ahead. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're free. <laughs> Oh my god. Okay, let's just watch Gypsy Tips. Girl, she gotta edit this shit. <laughs> she gotta edit this shit. Oh god. So many reactors don't want to react to this movie just because they don't want to edit this shit down. <laughs> Let me go ahead and turn this down in my ear because y'all not about to set me up. Uh -oh. <laughs> no, 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 no. It's so, this is such a fast movie. It's only an hour and 21 minutes, which tells me we're just going to jump right into it. That's how long it is? I thought it was like two hours or two and a half hours. It's only an hour and 21 minutes. That's it? Oh. Okay. Well, that's not as bad as I heard then. See, you can't, you have to find out for yourself. You can't just go by hearsay. You see what happens when you go by hearsay. Mm -mm -mm. Is my shepherd. I don't know anything about this movie. I think it's something to do with murders. And I know it's found footage. This sounds like some like some dark web stuff. Doesn't it sound, the, that sounds like some dark web stuff. Doesn't it sound like the, that kind of vibe? It's like the Poughkeepsie tapes on 4chan or some, some, something like that. You know what I'm saying? It's just like something, you know, you think it, it might have been cursed. And you as soon as it's in your possession, you have a whole like conjuring by the whole conjuring thingy and they have to get Ed and Lorraine Lauren come back bring them back to life so they could exercise your house it's a whole thing is this her funeral the story of Cheryl Dempsey oh, okay became is truly <laughs> one of the strangest most disturbing things I've ever come what she became and I've been doing this for close to 25 years now you look like you've been doing this for 25 years, sir. You look, look like 10 miles of long, hard road, sir. Ooh. 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 That, ooh. Yeah, let me go ahead and get blankets already here. We already ready. That man had a beak on him. Did you see that big old beak? I thought I had a beak on me. He has a beak on him. God dang. Oh, what the f You just fudge. pulled a body out of the grave? That's dark web stuff. The That's that. Tapes. This looked like it would take place in the 90s, but I don't actually know. The, the girl, this actually looks like... I can see maybe 90s, but I... I d during that whole... That l one sequence, it kind of looked 80s. But anything that looks like lots of footage of lots of dense force always kind of reminds me of 80s for some reason. I don't know why. Maybe it's the film grain. This looks like 80s right it's here. Easy. This film grain. This looks mm. 80s. <laughs> so Ominous. So that was just like a... I don't know. I had to let that out. I was like holding it in for a while. Part one. There's parts. I had a tenant in this house here who was a very <laughs> terrible person. I'm sorry. This seems like a parody. <laughs> This is the house where they found the Poughkeepsie tapes. Mm, I had to get real serious real quick, sorry. It was my job to watch and log all 2,400 hours of the Poughkeepsie tapes. First month alone, I couldn't sleep for more than an hour or two at night. <laughs> Torturing and murdering, turn him on, or a memento that he can save for long after the murder. One guy, one cup. Is that what this is? One night, I brought some of the tapes home with me. My wife watched about half an hour of one of the tapes and a year before she let me touch her again. I think that's a you problem. Yeah, it's probably the I think she used that music as an excuse. Yeah. She'd be like, you can't touch me anymore. The tapes. When we searched the yard, we found the. He looks so vanilla. Like, I, you know, all he loves to do is just the missionary, and that is it. And then it's probably still, he's probably still in his, like, in his. <laughs> pajamas he just sticks it out of the hole of his pants he doesn't even get naked he looks like that type of guy he, he like real like not sexy about it at all he just looks like he just doesn't even talk dirty or even whisper in your ear or even kiss you goodnight he just looks like he just you know pump and done type of dude 
Poor, that's the reason why the wife stopped. Anyway. The bodies of two women. Ah. Uh, there. Ah. There. <laughs> I'm sorry. This seems like I'm watching Parks and Recs low key. Like, Parks and Recs tried to do a horror episode. Honey, you've got a big storm coming. <laughs> Mockumentary styles have like ruined my brain. It's obvious that they'd all been killed in a horrific manner. All we need is Ron Swanson, April Ludgate in this scene. This it really like be the chef's kiss. So we just got bodies in the backyard. Inside me here is one complete set of these. That's things. a lot of work. Those are all tapes? Is he about to walk for five more minutes? When people Good. think of serial killers. He, that's a whole blockbuster video right there. He has. He could like set up a whole block, like a whole messed up blockbuster video. But it, a, a blockbuster video, no, nonetheless. It's crazy. They think of four or five people, you know. This is about one person. One person he killed. Are somewhere between 25 and 50 active serial killers in america i wonder if serial killers have gotten more like under control with all the technology of today or if they're still kind of like overall i think they just just like everything they learn to adapt this newer generation of psycho killers they just learned to d adapt that's crazy that, that's exactly what that is the old school serial killers can't make it this day and that. But these new ones that grow up in this technology and all that stuff, I can guarantee you they figured out how to like mask their face and do this and do that. I, I guarantee you, they always adapt. Crazies know how to adapt. Evil always does. You know how it is. For 100 hours of weird balloon stuff on these tapes. Balloon stuff? Oh, you're into balloon stuff? So we're into balloons. Like this? She's going to pop it. Yeah. Jesus, pop sir. It. I, drop it. I don't know why. I know it's going to pop, but it's going to scare me. First blood. Three of you will go home tonight and decide that this is not what you want with your life. Some yep. Terrible people in this world who yep. do unbelievably terrible things. Mm. That's a, that's a, that's got a fight, lost that's a the job, truth. got left by his wife, something like that. Ooh, no this give me ID channel. Doesn't that little the the silhouettes the 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 cheap generic you know dollar store uh, video videos they use stock stock footage they use in those ID channel things fabulous out in his car and at some point said the next vulnerable person I see is dead. I do have to say that I like that the fact that this is told through the point of view of like, oh, it's a documentary of the FBI investigations and things like that. Type. Okay, so, this, this. so this is the serial killer. I thought she said, I, girl. girl, I thought she was going to say, this little girl is the serial killer. <laughs> That'd be a twist. This little girl playing with her teddy bear, she's the serial killer. <laughs> Very unassuming. But no, I I hate it when they always like target children. That's horrible. Hi. Ew. Mm mm. Run aside. Stranger Run danger. Aside. Yeah. I like your dolls. I do. I said I like your dolls. Put it okay. I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. Good. Now go inside. Now run. If, if I was the big bad wolf, there's nothing you can do about it. Cool. Ew. Wanna bet. Wanna bet. What, you want to say something to the camera? Uh-uh, he's getting too close. Uh, I want to punch him so bad. I am a happy, pretty little girl. No. Good, now go outside. Uh, yeah, why are you just sitting there like a bump on the log now? Come where, on now. Where, Mom and Daddy, your child is in... Oh, hit her, he took her. He just hit her and he just took her. He has her, he goes put her in the trunk. You know what? You just took a white little girl. They about to be on your ass. You <laughs> took a white little girl. They, everybody, about to be an uproar. Another little white girl that fell down the well. Like she had been hit in the head with a blunt object. We found the <laughs> white girl fell down the well. That clip. She threw a back clip. You work, girl. She. <laughs> Wait, I gotta watch that again. Hold on, girl. Hold on. Why? Why is why is my shit not working? <laughs> it's bootleg keyboard i got right here hold on that shit was funny jay the way she said it was hilarious you know what you just took a white little girl they about to be on your ass you took 
a white little girl. They, everybody, is about to be an uproar. Another little white girl that fell down the well. Like she had been hit in the head with a blunt object. <laughs> uh, so, it's so... <laughs> I should be... <laughs> This is supposed to be a serious thing. <laughs> it's my defense mechanism. We found there was a missing girl, Jennifer Gorman. Poor Jennifer. Poor girl. girl. Description last seen in similar clothes. Ugh. I had a with my daughter. I think somebody took her. Like, there's blood out there. Please do something. Person, we have to wait 24 hours. That is the stupidest rule I've ever heard. That is. We have to wait 24 hours. Okay, let's give the killer a whole day to figure out how they're going to torment, torture, and kill, you know, said kidnapped person. That's so stupid. Like, it's a, like a five-year-old little girl. She is missing. What kind of a, a sick bastard, right? She blood. Footprint. <laughs> oh my god, I thought that was John Travolta for a second. His acting is a little bit questionable, but... I mean, it still it's got me. I'm, I'm a little shooky. Ain't gonna lie. No, I think they did a great job. I think they actually hired Hallmark and ID actors for this because I think they, it's very D less acting. It's perfect, actually. Hey, you having a little car problem? Yeah. This oh Lord, that Jennifer for Aniston. Would I get a lift into the next town? No. Oh. Hop in. Yeah, no problem. Hop in. Bob, why did you do that? I left that man on the side of the road. Not Bob. The it's right his name here. Really. Just a couple miles off the freeway. Mom's over back then. Yeah, not really. He don't he not he not from there, but he know how to get places. Yeah. That's not that don't add up. No, uh -uh, no, no red flags. Stupid. Just stupid. Just stupid. There's not gonna be a gas station in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I don't like how real this looks, though. A Poughkeepsie yeah. couple vanished over the weekend, seemingly without a trace. Oh, Poughkeepsie's the town. Authorities still have. Oh, that makes so much more. Poughkeepsie is actually the name of it. That sounds about right because there's some towns that has some wild names that you're like, where in the? How did you come up with this? And they, it, oh, this is the. The name of the person who founded this place, their name was, you know, Cheese McGee or something like that. You're like, oh, wow. That's fascinating. You know. Uh. No leads as to the couple's whereabouts. Here is a man who's figured out he's good at something. He's good because they stupid. <laughs> it's like. Places it over her mouth. With his left hand holding the camera, he's reaching it out and holding it in front of her face like this. This looks like he's very, he, this looks like he, this is very normal for him, doesn't he? He's just like, this is how you normally do it. Right here, yep, you see that? That's how you, uh, do the, yeah, yeah. this looks like he's done this before, just saying. Check this man's uh, background. He's sick. He was literally like, like he's filming it on purpose. Like, look at what I'm doing. He knows that it's only a mile or two off the freeway. In fact, the station is abandoned. I bet he knows that too. And he had a ready-made excuse for the camera. That man said nothing. <laughs> this man is what we call a mixed killer. He's a biracial killer? He's biracial. Wake up. <laughs> Come on, wake up. He really wanted just her. Which is even worse. Like, your husband, whatever he was, like, being stupid got you in this situation. Is that him saying that? Did he stab her? Today, the search for a missing Poughkeepsie couple ends tragically in a wooded area of rural Pennsylvania. The corpse had a head. Ooh, Pennsylvania girl. <laughs> that state gives me flashbacks. <laughs> like, oh, that weather. <laughs> the weather. The we that weather. Ooh, the ice and sleet and all that. I, I, I'm still traumatized from that state. It's placed in its abdomen in a... What? <laughs> I'm glad you had it. I, I don't give two shits to know what happened to him. This is two murders, not one. I That's mean, disgusting. put the husband's head in her body. <sighs> That's trifling. <laughs> There's no, no see that's so much extra work. You're you're doing too much at that point. You know, you're just doing too much at that point. In my opinion, I don't know. 
every gas station along the route. It took some doing, but we did manage to get our first video image of the killer in this manner. I want to see him. But he just, he signed something. Anybody know what he's saying? Red House. We found the second body in the woods behind a place called the Red House Tavern. Mm. So he wanted them to find it. He signed this before he even met the Andersons. <gasps> Ooh! Not only does he know Ooh. how to dispose of bodies, he knows how to dispose of bodies in many different ways. Elizabeth Jackson was abducted in hands. Another one. The killer then took a circular saw cut off her head and hands. It's almost impossible to put it on. Oh, not the fingers. There may be a... That's her, is that her head? Between finding the head and the torso. <laughs> Bye, bro. Here's a killer who understands. That, that's not the best place to stop. But she looks like that uh, Sarah Silverman. Doesn't she? Sarah Silverman? Understands bureaucracy. <laughs> Here is a killer who understands bureaucracy. <laughs> Usually a killer won't think through their first dismembering. So they go out in the garage and get a saw and take some hours to get the head off. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That was funny. They'll often go and get a real saw, something that like cuts you, sir. Through quick and easy. Which one do you prefer? It's delivery. <laughs> I guess he just wanted someone to appreciate how good he is at this. And so, matter of fact, check some of these people who are doing uh, in front of this camera. Check some of these people, questionable people too. I, I kind of question some of these people. They're in, they're interviewing. The thought that maybe we'd be strangely sort of impressed with it. Are you? No. No. After seeing what he did to Cheryl Dempsey, I could feel nothing but loathing for this guy. Oh, the other killings, you were proud of him, but this one, no. <laughs> <laughs> so he's just listening. And this is, is this the one that, like, is the, the big one that, like, he just did the, the most on? This man just welcomed himself into her home like it was his. What is he going to do? Make That's a cheese sandwich? That's cold-blooded if he killed you with your own knife. Not his own. He went to your kitchen and got your knife. <laughs> you bought at Home Goods for $25. Not he the... your knife. That's strange. Spe specific, Jay. That's <laughs> strange. Specifically, Home Goods for $25. How was that knife set, girl? Is it good? <laughs> she that was very specific. <laughs> that the whole that the whole could have been Target, maybe Wally World, maybe <laughs> Home Goods. Home Goods. I never shopped at Home Goods. Have you guys ever shopped at Home Goods? Let me know in the comments. How is the Home Goods? I heard they're really pricey, but I'm also very cheap too because I've been poor all my life. So, uh, you know, to me, Target is kind of like ooh, it's like the whole foods of like you know retail don't judge me this is why i'm paranoid when i'm taking showers That's mm -hmm. for sure. hello is that you him tim ain't say nothing so now you should be concerned or even get the soap out your eye You're ready to fight hello hello oh oh is he imitating what ice cream did you want oh no i thought we... done him to look around better like ugh, oh no. oh he looked like the plague doctor and everything <laughs> he's right there <laughs> you scare me you shouldn't jump out at somebody like that sorry Tim I caught his hands you wanna stay here for a while maybe for a long while I got the most awkward relationship <laughs> that him in the like yes mm -hmm. that's him. he's still in there he oh he got he he must be paid a mask oh. on yeah yeah he, yeah that's a horrific mask. oh that's so important <laughs> starting to fall asleep I don't feel that I would feel just like his presence like I movement nothing <laughs> I think I might too <laughs> he is right there yeah anyway. nothing <laughs> what the f Oh, I just saw it. Run, run, get up, run, girl. 
this you reason why you, this, no this reason why this reason why you shouldn't have tile floors they're nice and everything and if you have pets you can sweep up real quick but this is the reason why you shouldn't have tile floors you'd be slipping and sliding and all that nonsense when you're in uh in this situation i mean we're all in this situation every day right but uh <laughs> running for our lives but uh no that's the whole that mm -mm. girl you done you done you should have carpeting i was not expecting it to just pop off like that Ooh. okay all right all right three days before she she's already done she told me sometimes i feel like maybe someone's following me around Ooh, she should have tortured this girl. She should have listened to that. Oh! <gasps> no, 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 That's no, no, horrible. no, 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 I can't do stuff like this. No, 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 no. Mm -mm, no, this is some dark web shit right here. That's what you talk. About. That's what I'm talking about. That's some torture porn, dark web sound. Looking. Oh no, no. Girl. Mm -mm. Please don't hurt me. Is it two people? Oh no, it's one. It was a shadow. Shut up! Run! What the f? Yeah. What the f? I can't. Uh, no. I didn't. His head had been crushed in, kind of like this. He had been cut from his anus up to his throat. What? His genitals had been removed and they were placed in a sock drawer. He put him in a sock, sock drawer? drawer? Probably dumped her body in the woods. No, no. I wish he would have dumped her body in the woods. Truth we later learned from the Poughkeepsie tapes was that this killer had carefully crafted the murder site to mislead us. Coupled with his our sense of theatricality and masks and costumes and whatnot shows that this man is extremely mentally ill. Yo, I just... You I, think? I, I, <laughs> what? Uh, this character went out of fashion hundreds of years ago. It's Dottore Pest, the doctor of the plague. Did I say plague doctor, bitches? Did I say that plague doctor? And that's the mask you Oh my god, we're back mm -hmm. to her. What? Hold on. Let me get it together. Wait, wait. Okay. <laughs> I hate torture. I hate torture. I, I do hate too. Torture. Especially when it like, looks real like this. I killed your whole family. And he didn't. He's just telling her this. Tell me! They want to be Phantom of the Opera so bad. Not for real. No, no. Ah. Uh, uh. He about to put her head underwater. <laughs> Watch this. Oh no 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 no. Finish! Why? Why? You're happy? I killed your parents. Just kill me, bro. Just kill me. Yeah, for real. You don't have parents. You're a slave. He said, you don't have parents. You are a slave. I'm so uncomfortable. <laughs> I've never been this disturbed. This is on the level of, like, human centipede and all the, the tusks for saying. me. Like, yeah. Who do you like? You. Who? Only you. I punch in, bro. I, oh, my God. I hate this. Did you want me to kill those people? <laughs> yes. I don't know. Yes. That's why I did it. <laughs> Thank you, Pastor. This is my biggest fear. This is my biggest yeah. fear. <sighs> yeah. Please bring my daughter back home. Oh, he just going up to her house. Where are the cops? Stop this man. If if there's anything I can do to help, please let let me know. Thanks. These are literally the dumbest cops ever. So you're just gonna let a random man walk up? <laughs> oh my god. Is he laughing? I play that moment in my head over and over again. Why did she say, oh my god? I knew it was him, and I didn't stop him because I was scared. Oh, she. God. That's why you conceal and carry, baby. Just in those moments to be like, oh, you know what? I could do, I could catch a case in a, uh, this, that motherfucker. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. End it all right now with that the, that man right there. Think he gonna laugh and run up now. Mm -mm -mm. Too bad you were in Texas, girl. I don't want to see any more of this, bro. 
They gonna throw it at her. Oh. She's gonna drink that with a gag in her mouth. <sighs> Fucking disgusting. Oh my god. What the f- I just feel so bad. I'm just so disturbed. Uh, By the summer of 93, the area was really starting to feel the effects of this man's- How long did he have her? This killer did something quite unique. He kept killing, but changed his M.O. What? You they did this in all and it was an hour and 20 minute movie. Oh my god, this is the longest hour and 20 minute movie, Jay. I feel so bad for you. Do that here! Wait for a friend? <laughs> you almost stop talking to this man. Oh, that was easy. He really just went up to her. So she's just there while he's doing the other murders now. We started getting word from the prostitutes that worked that area. The girls are getting arrested, never being heard from again. This is insane. This is actually insane. Well, I should... no, no, no. And Cheryl... No. Mm -mm. And she got witness that shit too. I'd rather deal with demons. Yeah. I'd rather deal with demons. <laughs> what is that a knife? He's gonna make her kill her. He's gonna make her kill her. He gave her the knife. <gasps> All of the victims. <sighs> I can't That's even like, talk this movie because what am I watching? Slice from mouth to ear. Found matching sperm on four of the bodies. This is the sickest man in the world of sick men. Like no shit. Theodore Robert Bundy. This man. I remember the first question he asked me was, "Did he rape her?" Oh, he talked to Ted Bundy about this. <laughs> what? I mean, what else are you going to do at this point? You got to talk to other crazy people to get to the other crazy people. I mean, that's actually ingenious. That's actually ingenious. Uh, yeah. Who else is uh who has who's an expertise of being a crazy one? Hi, uh, we're so. Mm 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 mm. Let the girls run, please. Sure. Why don't why don't why don't you come in? No. 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 Why is there no adult with them? You know, there's a lot of weirdos out there, but I'm uh. a policeman, so it's okay. Hmm. <laughs> I just want to know peace for a day. Like, I just want to know peace for like five minutes of this movie, please. This is the wrong movie, no. apparently. Thank you. Oh, don't drink anything. Look at little mom on the right. She waited. She looked at it. Hey, did you? She didn't drink hers. No, I live over on DuPont. That's where she live. Do you, do you tell your, your parents where you go? Yep, I tell them the coordinates, the exact yep. street, the addresses. This one, my child is my child is getting an air tag. I'm on them at all times. Yeah, no shit. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sounds like I'm not going to be able to get cookies today. That's great. Get a raccoon in the basement sometimes. There's no raccoons around here. I'm good. Yeah. Let them know. Let them know. know. You want to see no. the in the basement? No. I no, it doesn't sound so like close. a creepy. You let yourselves out. You should go home and tell your mom about the raccoon that was in the basement of that man's house. Then your parents need to visit for this man even uh, inviting little girls into his home. Sounds like something got loose down there. Oh wait. Oh, I hate the noises. Uh, this mask is gonna haunt me in my sleep forever. Oh my I'm just happy imagine? the little girls got away. We found an unwashed glass of water. It had a fingerprint. They came back with a match. They matched my partner, Jim Foley. Hmm. We knew we had our man. That's him? I wanna elbow him. Couple times. Are you sure that's him? Death, good. Good. When they came and arrested my dad. We had a son? This reminds me of the Clove Hitch killer. Foley had no alibi for these murders because he was a cop. Oh, he was an actual cop. I thought he was lying. Secondly, he had a history of getting prostitutes. Cindy Jackson took the stand and- Come on, Sydney. 
Oh, so I thought it was like a rouge. Like they found, you know, in seven, he was using other people's like, or he just cutting off his. So they actually did get him. Or, I'm proud of you, girl. Kept telling him, Jim, they're going to kill you if you don't cop a plea. Good. I had to hope he didn't cop that plea. Guilty. <laughs> Good. I hope so. My father, it's over and he needs to be punished. Thanks. Oh, it's going to be so sad. But I think that your life should be spared. What? I do know, like, some people are like, no, it's the death penalty because that's, like, the easy way. Or, like, whether or not they should, like, rot and think about for the rest of their life what they've done. I don't know. Kill him. Kill him. Why? Why, why make him? He didn't let those poor people live. No. 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 Why have him? Why have we... Why should we pay for him to be locked up and pay for it? It's going to come out of our the taxpayers' money to feed him and to have him a cop. No, no, no. Mm -mm, mm -mm. We are overrun in our in our hospitals and our prison system. Get rid of the trash. Oh, we need voice. the room. The governor has not granted reprieve. James Foley will be executed within the hour. Good. Mm. Okay. All right. Mm -mm. All the women he killed. He's afforded the opportunity for prayer. The condemned has declined this also. I bet he did. Lucifer. You know, this is when I think they should have brought back like the brutal ways of torture. Did like the Game of Thrones thing where they like pour like hot gold on his head or something. Something Ooh. really harsh and cruel. He don't deserve just an injection. James Foley died by lethal injection, 1224 in the morning, September 9, 2001. I would have been in first grade. Part six missed one. So she's still, she's still there. They said, you got to get down there and see this. It was another body. A Shelby, Shelly, what was her name? <laughs> one of those. Cheryl? I don't know. <laughs> Jury convicted and sentenced Foley to death. Good. I couldn't even finish the Dahmer Netflix. That's, is that her? Three days after my dad's execution, I realized that he had been innocent. The article on dad gets bumped down to page six. Wait, what? Former cop cleared of charges after execution. Nobody heard that they found him innocent because of 9-11. <laughs> what? Serial killer kills cop using justice system. In September 11th happened, no one gave a shit. Well, yeah, because I mean, only preys on prostitutes. If you're not a prostitute, your defenses are going to go back down. Hi. Hi, you having some car trouble? Oh, yeah. That wasn't him? Oh, my. Didn't I say that? Didn't I find that that was a little bit suspect that if he was that clever to do all this stuff, that he's going to be just leaving fingerprints around? Come on now. I didn't think that was that easy. My God. You know, you, you really shouldn't be out here by yourself with that Water Street butcher on the loose and all. <laughs> Mm -hmm. it's, it's 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 him it's it's let me drop you there then you won't have to wait out here alone you wouldn't mm. mind <laughs> not at all i'll be arrested yeah you you ever been arrested so it's another cop on the force i need them to get like an undercover cover like woman cop or something to like i don't know roam the streets and figure out who this man is where is olivia benson we need her all right thank you to the gas station there we go yeah can, can, can i ask you something no why did you call me, officer? The police liked it when you called them. That. Well, they, they do, but... I'm not one. I'm, I'm not a cop. You're not. No. I'm a serial killer. That's not very funny. Girl, smash the window. How to open the door. Who are you, then? I'm a butcher. Very funny. Yeah. Girl, I need you to try to open the door. I know it's probably locked, but just... I oh, bet that's what I'm saying, girl. Here. Where are you going? What's yeah. this? Well, how about this? I'll make you a deal. Yeah. We'll we'll pull over, yes. and I'm gonna rape you. What? Then, if you've been good, and you haven't done anything stupid, I won't kill you. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. No. Poor baby. She, what else is she gonna say besides okay? You're not just gonna let me rape you. Yes, I, yes, I am. I don't believe you. Not me watching this during Women's History Month. What? That Obviously, I wouldn't leave handles on the doors. Oh my god. Now she had the sudden realization. 
Uh-uh. I just start kicking. I don't know. I don't know. What do you even do? What do you do? What do you do? This is terrifying. The noises. Oh my god. The fact that they, they, they still haven't found this man is crazy. <laughs> what is that? What is that? I don't do the crawling. I don't do the crawling and it's got faster. Is that oh girl? Is that him? That's him, girl. Girl, you better be happy you can't see what that was. I'm tired. Him? He's just wearing the another mask on his head. I hate. What is he about to do with that? <laughs> Ow! Ah! 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 Oh, uh, 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 uh. <laughs> why, bro? I'm never going outside again. I'm just not. I'm not interacting with any men. I'm not going outside. <laughs> I just think that's how I live the rest of my life. This killer knows how to play the profile exactly the way he wants. Let me read a couple of these profiles. Disorganized, lives alone, mm. sadist, sadistic. At least we got that part, right? <sighs> See, I don't know. They got, they got no clue. They're lost. I led the assault on the house. As I like to say, uh, we dropped the whole hammer on him. Took y'all long enough. He's so happy and so cocky about it. You took too long. Should have did this five women ago. Clear! 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 And this house just looks like a normal family home. Ask me <clears throat> how we found him. First, we didn't find him. <sighs> Why am I not surprised? to find it. Because it suck. Of course you didn't find it. Further evidenced by the fact that there was not one single fingerprint in the entire house. Wow. Hey guys, come come here. You ready? Mm, it's a body. Is she alive? Medic in here. Get a medic in here now. I would not want to live for that. Honestly, I didn't. Do, I wouldn't. I, would, I no. wouldn't. All the trauma you're about to know. People kept trying to tell me all those years that I should probably start to move on, but I wouldn't. Mm. But then I got the call. Kept that slave in Poughkeepsie. We found your daughter. She had been burned, mm. cut. She had five teeth removed by pliers. Oh. Oh, those poor broken bones. Not only mm -mm. there also was a severe sexual torture. I'm sure. Electrocution of genitals. What? Things that are too horrible to say out loud. Good. Don't say it. Don't say it. I don't know. Brutal pain had been such a huge part of her life for so long, she didn't know how to exist without it. Well, I, I can't imagine. <sighs> Seeing Cheryl after all that time. How long was she in there? It was hard to see the girl that I loved and the girl that came back. She's never going to be the same. No. She can't. Like, there's no way for you to be the same. Mm -hmm. After months of lobbying the MCs, we got an interview with their daughter. I'm scared. Oh, I wouldn't even like that's traumatic. He loved me. He never lets me say it, but it's true. Mm mm. This is a trauma bond now. <laughs> what? That's so sad. That's actually so sad. I I do. The recently buried Girl. body of Cheryl Dempsey was stolen from her grave. It happened here last night at Woodlawn Cemetery. The feeling is that... The fact that they have not caught this man is killing me. There were 27 tapes missing when we found them. I wonder if they were just too private for him to let anyone see. Or maybe they were worse than anything that we've seen. Probably. Probably that part. If this documentary thing you're making ever gets to the theaters, he won't be able to help himself. He'll see this movie as many times as he can. I believe that. That's so sad. For Cheryl Dempsey. Mm. And with those you lost too soon, may they never be forgotten. And they have the names. If I'm correct, this is not actually a true story. They made it because it seemed like it was so real that people were like terrified. I've never been so disturbed. They did so good with how real everything came across. Like I said, I love the story of like, this is a documentary about, you know, a serial killer. As if you were watching like the Reels channel, you know? I'm 
so I just can't get some images the out of my head right now. This was actually like memories. a really, it's a good scary movie. Like I'm terrified. To me, an aspect of watching a good scary movie is obviously being scared by it. Whether or not it's like jump scares or whatever, but it keeps you in and drilled in because you're fascinated by what is this man doing? The fact that they leave it so open ended with him never being caught and Cheryl Dempsey still being well was you know being alive was just oh my god this was a choice for my found footage journey glad i can check it off my list honestly because well, will i come back to it probably not if you I'm guys enjoyed you. this and liked watching me be traumatized and want to see the full reaction then you can head over to patreon or just join below uh to my youtube and get access to the full watch along follow me on twitter because i will be talking about this movie and how much it hurt me I don't despise the movie. I think the movie was actually really great, but I hate how real it was and how much I'm just affected by it. Join the Discord because sometimes I do try to do some movie nights in there. Yeah, thank you guys for watching and I uh, can't wait to traumatize myself some more with some more found footage. As always, leave me some suggestions below and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys later. If I make it through the night. That was good. That was good. That was good. That was, she did a great job editing it. I feel bad that she had to watch it though. I mean, that movie, if that is true, okay. I, I, a lot of them are just, you know, fictional stories. So if this is fictional, they did a very good job, like she said. I think the reason why they probably did their homework on some dark web stuff, in my opinion, because that's, very just just too on the nose not like i've seen dark web stuff but you hear stories i've there's so many dark web videos that they talk about on here on youtube and here in general that the stories that you hear and these stories about that 4chan and and all these other th just horrific things horrific so it wouldn't surprise me maybe they did their some homework and took some liberties and stuff like that took some ideas got some inspiration off some of that stuff it wouldn't surprise me because it really falls in that kind of lines like i it made my soul just watching this this just a few clips hurt my soul a little bit it hurt my soul <laughs> because i was just like oh my god jesus christ like it's just that kind of like oh my god it's just like what kind of horrific things it makes you not want to leave the house anyway this was a good reaction jay bless her heart uh give her some prayers and love because oh she had to watch the whole thing girl i i love you to death i will not probably will not watch the full length reaction i doubt of this movie but any other movie that you've done i would love to see the full length reaction of not particularly this one uh no offense <laughs> i'm good with this one this one i i'm good with the with the with the with the highlight reel we watched that was it, it, it's, that's good enough um whew. so anyway like and subscribe all that good stuff and yeah take care of yourself take care of each other love peace and grace and bye